When looking at buying a projector, you want precision performance and in terms of pixel quality, perfect clarity. And I think with the ViewSonic M2, we may have just found it. Let me introduce to you a projector that apparently offers the central elegance of luxury, but also provides superb audio and visuals with a big screen experience even whilst you're on the go. For example, in terms of picture quality, well, this uses Cinema Super Color Plus technology. And then when it comes to sound performance, it has dual built-in Harman Kardon speakers. So let's get this open then. Well, let me lift that up. I'm gonna pull this out of here nice and gently and look at that. Bold, elegant, stylish, smart. And I've only just taken out of the box well, in terms of looking professional, I think they have done it remarkably well. I love the color scheme they've chosen too. It's a very bold matte black on the top, but it's surrounded by this luxury bronze color around the sides. But you know what I really do like? The ViewSonic logo is located on the top, and if you turn it to the side, then there is the Harman Kardon logo. And I think ViewSonic just wants to show the consumer that they really have spared no expense when it comes to the technology used in the M2 projector. Now, in regards to the connections, well, they are located on the back. And we have here a on-off power switch. We also have a USB-C input. We've got a HDMI input, which is HDCP 2.2 compliance. So basically that means it is 4K future-proof. You have a DC power supply input, you've got a micro SD card reader, a USB-A output and input, and finally an audio out 3.5 millimeter jack thrown in there as well. Now I like what they've done here. If you remove this little cover, this is where you'll find a hidden input for the Wi-Fi dongle, as well as a micro USB connection there too. But if I replace this back on here and then lift this up, that's right, it is in fact a miniature adjustable stand. But that really is a very suave piece of equipment, but we're gonna put that to one side now and just check out what else comes in this box. Well, we are met with another box, and in this is, in fact, the remote control, Wi-Fi dongle, and batteries, and that is a very nice and luxurious remote. For those of you who wish to see the wireless dongle, well, there it is. It's just a USB stick, but it's all there, present and correct. We also have the ViewSonic M-Series user manual, Oh wow, and look at this, look at this. It is a wonderful, nice looking carry case. And last but not least, with this never ending box of tricks here, well, we are messed with a few power adapter options. Obviously you've got the UK one there. You then have a two pin one as well. There is the rest of the adapter. And then they've even thrown in a USB-C cable there too. So that is the unboxing all done and dusted. I'm gonna place that down there out the way and just tell you quickly about the specifications of what this wonderful ViewSonic projector can provide you. Now this projector not only looks smart, but it really does house some incredible features. So we'll start off with the resolution, which is of course 1920 by 1080. The brightness is 1200 LED lumens. It has a staggering contrast ratio of 3 million to one. It can handle up to 1.07 billion colors. The screen size can be between 24 and 100 inches. It has a 30 degree horizontal keystone adjustment as well as a 40 degree vertical adjustment. It is compatible with both Amazon's Alexa as well as Google's Home Assistant. And finally, in terms of Bluetooth, it is version 4.0 compliant as well as offering Wi-Fi connection to both 2.4 and 5 gigahertz networks. So as you can see, it really is a phenomenal piece of kit. And just to throw it out there, by the way, this projector can run off a mobile power bank, which just goes to show you how low the power consumption is of the ViewSonic M2. But now it is time for the part I'm sure you've all been waiting for, which of course is setting all this up and just testing how good it really is. So once we turn it on, you are met with a bright and colorful introduction showing the ViewSonic logo. And the first thing I would like to mention, apart from the extremely time-saving autofocus as shown here, is the fact that the noise of the fan from this projector is practically non-existent. Now the operating system has loaded, I want to quickly show you what it has on offer. So by selecting the left hand box, this brings you to the downloadable app options. 
and there really are an awful lot to choose from, including the popular BBC iPlayer, Amazon Prime Video, and of course, Netflix. On the right, we have the App Center, where you will find all your installed apps. And then with the File Management option, this is how you access any connected USB or external hard drives. With the settings, you can alter anything from screen, picture, and sound adjustments to Wi-Fi and software setup. Before finally checking out the screen mirroring option, which tells you basically how to cast your smartphones to this projector. And yes, don't worry, it works for both Android and iOS devices. So now let's load up some footage and just check out the ViewSonic M2 in action. This warehouse is where you and your government have hidden all of your secrets, yes? This is a military warehouse, I've never been here before in my life. To begin with then, this is obviously Indiana Jones, presented here in a 1080p format. And although what you can see here is bright with stunning contrast, I just want to say that with the naked eye, it is 10 if not 20 times better. Honestly, it's astonishing how vivid with precision colour the projection image really is. You will help us find it. Now what I'm about to show here is in fact a 4K video file. And I've done this to see if the projector could handle such a vast amount of data. And as you can see, it easily does. There is no buffering or motion stutter. And although it is downgraded to HD, you lose absolutely nothing in terms of the tremendous amount of detail. For those of you who like animation or have children, then this is how the classic Toy Story 3 looks. And again, once more, it's absolutely flawless. The colours are not washed out, the motion is smooth, and basically, it's just perfect. What the heck? Yeah, that's better. Now, if you're an avid gamer, then of course you'll be glad to hear you can connect your games console to this projector. Now it states there is a 125 millisecond connection lag, but honestly you can't even notice it. There was no controller delay whilst I was playing and everything just felt precise, allowing me to sit back and immerse myself in the gameplay. For those of you who need this for presentations, well you can load up both Microsoft Word and PowerPoint files onto the M2 without the need for installing any additional software. You quite literally just plug in your device with the files on and then you can show your writing and pictures to the audience on the big screen. And of course, who can resist casting their phone onto a whopping 100 inch display? Now, like expected, unfortunately, pay-per-view apps won't work. But for the likes of YouTube or showing your files, then this is just a quick and easy process. Especially if you are someone who likes to take many a picture on your smartphone, because now, with this setup, you can show them off to everyone. And finally, how well does the ViewSonic work in light conditions? Well, I'll just turn on the bedroom light now. And I must say it performs exceptionally well, as you can see here. But when it comes to direct bright sunlight, like I thought, you do lose a lot of the overall image quality. It can still be watched, but like always, for the perfect film experience, my advice is to keep the light pollution down to a minimum. So there you go then, that was my quick demonstration of the ViewSonic M2. And in terms of a projector, this is just unbelievable. Let's begin by looking at the hardware itself. It's compact, lightweight, it's modern, it's slick, and of course, extremely smart. Then on the inside, ViewSonic have equipped it with everything to make your projecting experience not only trouble-free, but as cinematic as possible. 
the choice of inputs are contemporary, you have dual branded speakers, and of course, not forgetting the included options for Wi-Fi connectivity as well. When it comes to the built-in software, you'll be glad to know it's not only simplistic, but also easy to use. Whether it be choosing and downloading your favorite app, or even just adjusting the color and sound settings, everything is there to help you, no matter what you are planning to watch, have a complete and stress-free event. And finally, and of course, most importantly, you have the stunning clarity of the Pixel Quality 2. Not only is it sharp, it is breathtakingly faultless. Every detail, every movement is shown in its true beauty and throw that in with the incredible sound offered from the Harman Kardon speakers. I honestly can't explain enough just how fantastic watching a film on this projector really was. So in terms of cost, what will all this set you back then? Well, here in the UK, it currently retails at just under £700. And yes, the premium price may be off-putting for some, but for a first-class, hassle-free, as well as portable projector, then with the ViewSonic M2, you can't go wrong, as not only will it provide you with truly stunning pictures and sound, but also bring you the wow factor of the cinema experience straight into your home. And for this, I think it's well worth every single penny. Now, of course, as usual, before I go, don't forget to tell me your thoughts on the ViewSonic M2 in the comment section beneath this video. And not forgetting, if you like this video and you like tech, then please share your appreciation by giving this video a fantastic thumbs up. Don't forget to share it. And most importantly, hit me up on that classic subscribe button. But until next time, thank you once again for watching, and I hope to see you at some point very soon. Thank you.